Hello Cambly learners, my name is Simon and I'm a tutor on Cambly. Today we will be learning about the words illusion and illusion. Wow, they sound very similar. So let's take a peek at the dictionary and our first word is illusion and we can have that as a variable noun and the definition is an illusion is a false idea or belief. As a countable noun, I have a little example from the dictionary. An illusion is something that appears to exist or to be a particular thing, but does not actually exist or is in reality something else. Next up, we've got illusion. As a variable noun, an illusion is an indirect reference to someone or something. The title is perhaps an allusion to the author's childhood. So let's dive in there. Now we're going to start again with illusion. It is a countable noun with one, two, three syllables. Illusion. Illusion. Let's say it, everybody. Illusion. Illusion. Good job. So, one more time, quick review. What does illusion mean? Well, illusion means a false idea or belief, typically in a situation involving someone or something. Now, I have some examples. So let's go for it. She's under the illusion that I will pay her bill. Wow. Or the students have no illusions that the job market is tough. Moving on to our next word, illusion. It can be both countable and an uncountable noun. It also has three syllables. A, lu, jin. Illusion. Illusion. Nice. Good job. Well done. Illusion means something said or written that indirectly refers to another person or a thing. For example, Megan was hurt by an illusion to her failure. Or, he made no allusions to bumping into the car in the car park. <gasps> oh no! So, time for a review. First question, how many syllables are there in the words illusion and illusion? Three syllables. Very good. Next question. Can you give an example of a situation where someone might have an illusion about something? Well, my answer would be a student might have an illusion that they can study for their exam the night before and still get an A plus if only. Next question. Can you provide an example of a situation where someone made no allusions to something that happened? Mm -hmm. A magician might make no allusions to how they performed a particular trick, keeping their secrets to themselves. First question. In the film, the director made many to the play of you from the bridge. Is that an illusion or illusion? Perfect. Illusion. Question two. And this one is a little bit romantic. Maybe, maybe not. It turns out our love was an 
he never truly cared about me. That's right, it was just an illusion. Finally, for those who are unfamiliar with Cambly, it's a platform that gives you instant access to friendly native English speakers, just like me. You can take English lessons anytime, anywhere, right from your phone or computer. Schedule your next lesson with me using the link below. Thanks so much for watching. Bye-bye for now and see you soon. Have a great day.